So I noticed a lot of people were having trouble while out painting an image specifically in Leonardo.ai's canvas editor. So I decided to cover this topic. So suppose you want to out paint an image. A lot of people were having trouble out painting an image. They were saying that they are not getting the specific desired result that they really want. So we are going to discuss the same in this video. Before we go any further, if you haven't seen my other videos regarding Leonardo.ai, I recommend go in the description down below and watch all the videos because I've covered Leonardo AI's features in depth. So watch that video and then come back to this video. And for those of you who have watched the videos, let's get into the video. Usually to outpaint an image, I go to AI canvas and then I go to upload image and then I choose from community, go to maybe top or trending and I select one image in order to outpaint the image. But now as uh, some of you were having issue out painting the image, I'm going to tell you a new workflow so that you can get your desired results. So now instead of putting in your own prompt in this section, we are going to copy the prompt of the original image in order to out paint the image. So go back to community feed and select images from that feed. For the sake of this video, I have liked a few images in order to outpaint them so let's try out painting this image right here so just go to this section and click on edit in canvas but before that just copy the prompt of this image in order to paste it in that section the prompt section in canvas editor now let's go to edit in canvas and now if you decrease the size of the image, place the bounding box on the image and paste the copy prompt in this section, see what result you get. As you can see, you got exactly what you expected out of the out painting and we've got pretty good options as well. I think this looks the best. So click on accept. Now let's do the same thing. Click on generate. Now let's try adding the structure or out painting the image without this original prompt that we copied to check whether we are getting the same trouble that a few of uh, my subscribers were getting or not. So let's write a simple prompt add structure add structure and then I'll click on generate. So when we wrote add structure, we got a completely different image. So it was not successfully outpainted this way. In some examples, it gets outpainted. If you write a more detailed prompt, like you write some building or some Japanese uh, showroom or shops or houses, something like that. But this is the best way. Now let's try pasting the same prompt that we copied and click on generate again. And as you can see, the image was successfully outpainted. This is because we added the copied prompt in order to outpaint the image. Let's do the same thing in the remaining part of the image. Now let's go back to the community feed or the liked section and select one more image that I have shortlisted. So I'm going to select this particular image right here and I'm going to copy the prompt and open it in canvas editor. Let's decrease the size of the image. Let's do the same experiment. Let's just write add structure and try adding some structure to the image.
as you can see in some cases it gives the exact same result but sometimes it gives a bit of trouble so you need to figure out if you are not able to successfully outpaint your images using this small prompt then you can simply just delete the prompt and copy the same prompt of the original image in order to get what you actually expected out of the outpainting so just do that just go right here and click on generate after copying the original prompt that you copied I think by now most of you must be clear on what the solution for the wrong outpainting image is. It's simply to copy the prompt of the original image and then to paste it in this section. You can also use this existing prompt in order to change some elements in the image. For example, you don't like this treehouse that already exists in the image. Just click on the erase option and erase out this already existing treehouse and let's try generating something completely different out of the same prompt just select the bounding box and bring it bring it exactly on top of this erased section and then just change the prompt a bit and then i'm going to click on generate and as you can see it completely changed the treehouse and it gave a couple of options that you can choose from I think this option looks pretty nice so I'm going to click on accept and this way you can create some amazing looking images you can use it in many other places other than this example obviously it just depends upon your imagination how and where do you use this amazing tool it's not the tool that is having some trouble it is your imagination and the way you experiment so try experimenting more and more I always say that this is the second best tool after mid journey and the images that this tool generates are really of high quality plus the interface is so good that you can generate images with ease and don't think that I I'm I'm sponsored by Leonardo AI or something it's just my favorite tool and I like playing around with this tool a lot so this was it for the video if you found any value in this video then subscribe to the channel and I'll meet you in my next video with some more AI related content. Now there'll be some fast forwarded video playing of some outpainting so enjoy that video. It was just done to reach the 10 minute mark so don't mind it.